We're in Tacoa on our way toward Hillen. We don't know exactly what we're going to be doing today, but we're at one of our favorite places in Tacoa. X Factor. This used to be a pharmacy, right? I mean, looking at this, like, you know, because, you know, you can see the soda fountains there and the bar and things like that. Look at the brick back there. I love buildings like this. I hope you can hear this. Can you hear me now? <laughs> I don't know what we're talking about. We've we're on an adventure. That. We had an incident last night. Paula got hit on her little itty bitty gray car. It's not her fault though. Nope. She was coming fault. up to a stop sign and somebody came around and hit her. Yep. So she's okay. He just said he didn't see her. Yep. And he admitted it was his fault. So. Yeah. It happens. It happens. She's okay. But like I told her last night, it can be fixed. She cannot. She can. We each ordered a salad. Her always gets um, Caesar salad. It looks good. I'm looking forward to this. I think it's house-made raspberry vinaigrette. Kurt ordered a Cuban panini. It's called Cuba. Cuba. And I ordered a chicken panini, so I Cuban. can't wait. Cuban panini. Food came, and basically our paninis look the same. Mine's better. How do you know it's better when you haven't tried mine yet? All right. Yours has got a bunch of green in it, man. Okay, so what's on it? Ham? Ham and something else. It, it, aren't Cubans like they have ham and some kind of pork? Yeah, pork. And then mustard, I know. And then. There's pickles in it. This looks good. It's good to eat. Yep. I got chicken. So it's got all sorts of stuff on it. This place is attached to. An antique store. Those old typewriters. Those are really cool. Okay, so if you're in downtown Tacoa, we're on Doyle Street, I believe. And yeah, well, duh, it says it right there. 27 Doyle Street, X Factor Grill. It is really yummy. Check it out. Yep, yummy, yummy. And it's attached to this antique store. You can walk from the restaurant here. On the inside. And if you're into antiques, this is a really neat place. Found some Disney glasses there. It's called Cornerstone Antique and Craft Market. Found some Disney glasses there one time. We found a lot of stuff. And uh, a bike. We got Paula's bike there when she oh, was right. young. Yeah. We usually head into Helen Park and just walk around. And we may possibly do that a little bit today, but this trip is a little bit different. We're stopping in a little area called Sauté Nakuchi. And our first stop is here at the old Sauté store. Okay, Kurt, what are you doing? <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. We're gonna check this out. I'm just gonna walk around and take a little video. I am. I have lots of old signs. Well, this is an old sign. Thetford's black draught for the liver. Mark Battle Axe shoes. They stand dissection and inspection. Okay then.
There we go, established 1872. I need to head on in because they left the door open. But look at the door. Look at all the nails in the door. Look at all that. It's really rusted. The refreshed drink, Bud Wine. Makes you glad you're thirsty. <laughs> okay. Holy cow. This is the, uh, old general store that is still open by the way yeah this is the stuff I dig Lee's still taking video outside. My phone pretty much does better video inside. I know she's the one that does most of the videos, but I can handle it. Oh, look at that, a cake slicer. That's too cool. the sewing machine and the boots wow this place is too cool um yeah okay let's not talk about that wow coffee grinder Saddles. Man, look at that. Bellows. Golly. Too cool. Way too cool. I missed the whole thing right there. There's an Indian. Actually, there are two. Wow. Tobacco. Oh, okay. You know, to hang and let dry. Gourds. Gourds. There's um horse bits horse bits. Yeah. Horses. Or bowls or whatever. Hey, are y'all? Nice yeah, fireplace. Hot. I noticed you had the dress before the car. Oh, I came up the steps and mom's friend was still on the trip. Kurt's found a cooler. He likes to try all these interesting flavors. They've got, right they've got beer. frosty orange soda. Yeah, oh, they have, um, that's clementine. Huh. Yeah, well, I clementines are thing. small. Like this yeah, this is a neat store. All right, we found these. There's a green one and a white one. 
I don't like these. Get a green one. Instead of the white? Yeah. There's the green. I like green. Green. Okay. Mm. Sold. Turn around again. There was a glare. There's still a glare. Oh, that's what I'm trying to. Yeah. I like it. Okay. Well, there's more outside. And I just came across this. I'm curious. How has this helped women for 50 years? watch where I'm walking. And right outside too, Old Salty Market. Now I see Mayfield, so they must have ice cream. We're going to have to see. More flowers out here. Look at the roof on this place. Yeah. Yeah, I like this place. Salty. I like the roof. I don't know if that's hard to maintain. How do you cut it? This place over here is an ice cream and like snacks. And then here's the restroom we're waiting on. When I was looking in this area, um, I saw that Salty Nakuchi Cultural Center. I think we might do that at another time. We're not gonna do that today, but I think we are going to do this. Stovall Mill Covered Bridge. I think we may go check that out. And I think that may be where we're going next. And then there's something across the street. And it says stores closing. Everything must go. I don't know what that is. The shop's at Sawtee Point. Okay, Kurt. Who does this remind you of? Adam the Woo always looks for phone booths. Nobody's home. That'd be a good place to put a cache, though, wouldn't it? Oh, yeah. So, Adam the Woo, if you're ever in this area, check it out. Yep. Look at that. That's all that's left in there. Snowball covered bridge. told us about this place and we have been here before I'm videoing across the street we go into this antique place all the time and then there's a winery right there 
But here's the place we're going in. It's called Nora Mills. And there's a sign right here. Established 1876. Watered, powered, and stone ground cornmeal grits and whole grains. But it's really neat in here. And we're in here, inside. This is really neat. Oh, that is heavy. This room smells really good. Got bath bombs over there. I think I smell those. Plus, these right here and this right here. Lavender laundry soap and sachets. They smell really good. Of now we made it to Helen. We're almost in the Helen. the dead cat on so I'm gonna hear a lot of road noise sorry all right coming back out we've decided to stop here Sweetwater coffee house now Kurt really prefers blended coffee but he got an iced coffee and you like it don't you now for me I am really picky about my coffee and usually coffee out somewhere I'm not happy with. I got their coffee of the day with two stevia and 2% milk and it is perfect. It's almost as good as mine at home, but it's this cute little place. And they're open till six o'clock on Saturdays. It's gonna be our second Adam the Woo reference of the day. I got my piping hot caffeinated beverage. Kurt got his cold beverage. And it is yummy. Be careful, you're on too. Okay. And you got a blueberry muffin too. But after this, I think we're heading home. Well, we're heading that way. <laughs> 